Hi, it's Irina again with the video pulling finished sentences apart and helping you understand what it is that they're saying. So today we're going to look at Tervetuloa Parsavi Goile, which is something that you see out and about town in spring quite a lot. Um, and I'll tell you what it means in just one sec. <laughs> So I love to take these little simple ads that you think, oh yeah, I know what that means, but sometimes we just take a lot of this stuff for granted, okay? Tervetuloa parsaviikoille. What does it mean? Okay, so let's look at tervetuloa. You've heard tervetuloa before. You've been tervetulut in different places, right? It means welcome, okay? Welcome. Um, parsa means um, asparagus. And the koile means like the week, the weeks to the weeks of asparagus. <laughs> so basically, what the sign is saying is uh, welcome to the asparagus weeks. A lot of restaurants in Helsinki will have, um, you know, special asparagus will be a special item on the menu because it's not available year round, at least not here. So that's, wow, I love this part. Okay, so tervetuloa, welcome. In English, too, you can think about it. Well, come. Okay, it's the exact same thing in Finnish. Terve is healthy. It also means hello, right? Tulo is, um, well, tulla is to come. And tulo is like arrive um, or arrival, right? So it's a healthy arrival. And in the previous video, we went over how when we wish someone something, we use the partitive case. So, and we add an A at the end. So that's why terve tu. Uh, sorry, terve tulo a is welcome and it's a wish, right? It's not just welcome, it's welcome, it's a wish, okay? So now taking a look at parsa viikoile, ooh, the good stuff. So parsa means asparagus, um, it's also my husband's nickname, has been since high school, I don't know why. Um, but in addition to that, so viikoile. In the previous video, if you haven't caught it, there's a bunch of stuff that relates to this one. So make sure to go back and check that one out. Um, I talked about the plural, right? So here we have viikoille. Now you can look at the very end and recognize LLE usually means two. So in this case, it's welcome to the asparagus weeks, right? This is not just one asparagus weeks. There are multiple asparagus weeks, okay? So the two is that LLE. E, and then the I there is a marker that tells us there's more than one week. This is plural, okay? And the, you'll notice that there were two Ks and now there's just, or you won't notice if you don't know, that V, go, which is week, is spelt um, with K-K-O at the end. And now there's just one K. So that is something that happens from time to time. But I don't want you to stress about that. I just want you to know, like, Look, you can recognize the word now. You can recognize the direction. You can recognize that there's plural in there. Um, and you can recognize from the picture that it's asparagus. And you know we're talking about weeks. And you know tervetuloa now. So just by starting to observe how these things pop up, how that plural marker shows up, how it's used with different cases, you can really start to build a rather um, broad amount of experiences just by looking at the five ads that we've looked at or the six ads or signs that we've looked at over the past couple of videos. So if you haven't watched all the videos, make sure to go back, look at them all. And even the tiniest of words or signs can be a really good lesson to help you understand like, why is it like this? Or if it's like this in this case, and I'll start to make connections, right? Um, this is something I find that is so fun in terms of just ongoing learning, right? It doesn't even matter what level you get to because some of the signs are so easy and some of them are expressing quite um, nuanced and subtle and highly complex, you know, grammar. Um, so have fun. Go out there. If you see any really awesome signs, make sure you send them to me. You can do so through my website at irinaforvet.com and there's a contact form there that you can fill out. Okay, and make sure you subscribe to this video uh, channel if you haven't already and join me for more of these um, pulling finish apart. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.